Hey guys, Ricardo here and welcome to the Blog Tech Tips. In today's tutorial guys, I'm going to show you to um, install unknown apps on your smart TV. The TV in question here is an Android smart TV that's running the Android OS. So if you have any smart TV that's running the Android OS, um, this should work for you. So it's a general tutorial. And of course, this particular model is a TCL. It can apply to anything at all, as I said, that's running... Um, the Android OS, all right? It might be slightly different on your TV, but the general layout tends to be the same. So unknown sources is when you want to install a third-party app. So for example, you download an APK online and you want to install it on your TV, it will not install by default. So you can modify the settings. So you can actually go ahead and install these apps. You can turn the feature on and off. So you're gonna get your remote. Here's my remote and you're gonna navigate you're going to go over to your gear icon, which is settings. You're going to go into all settings. Once you're in all settings, as seen here, you're going to go down to apps, since it has to do with the app. And of course, we're looking for unknown sources. Now, of course, unknown sources, you're going to go down. You're going to look through here. It's usually under your apps. So it's usually found under the app settings. So you're going to go down. In my case, it is under um, security and restrictions. And of course, if you select, there you go. It's giving you unknown sources. And it does clearly say that um, allows installation of apps of sources other than the Play Store. So it will allow third party apps. And if you look over here, you can always enable access to an app. And of course, make sure you download apps from trusted sources. So, for example, you can download. An app you can use it I will give it permission as you see here I can turn off access so I can keep it to allowed or not allowed so you can use the app and then disallow it or allow it and keep it in an allowed state so it's up to you the apps will appear here you can grant them permission but make sure that the feature itself is on for the specific app you want and of course make sure unknown sources is enabled all right so as you can see you can manage your unknown sources from here um in some devices allow you to turn the unknown sources on and off but of course in my case here i can individually control them so you can easily control your unknown apps all right so once you've done that you can go ahead and launch your unknown app and allow it to install on your device it should work flawlessly and of course it's quite easy all right do hope you enjoyed this tutorial as always ricardo from blog tech tips and until next time bye